About to start. You, uh, you gotta take a piss or something? Uh, now. What's the time? Thanks for your concern. Let's start this rodeo. <laughs> Can't just yet. Not till you get in the range. Go on, set up, chop chop. How many we got? Just six? God damn. Well, no point crying about it. <clears throat> Rules are simple, right? There's the target, shoot it. No matter which one, go on and shoot your neighbors. Most hits wins. Uh, meaning hits on the target, not your neighbor. Oh, right. Uh, small caliber iron only. Don't go showing off with your fucking assault bangers or no. Rocket pukers, got me? First prize is a pistol. But, uh, a, a real nice one. It's fucking nice, I'm telling you. Anyway, uh, enough words. Get warmed up. Ready? Three, two, hey, hey, the hell's that? The hell you doing with that double barrel? It's that small caliber only. Uh, forgot my iron. Must be in my other jacket. In a holster. A holster! Get the fuck out of my sight now! Fuck, Chum. Chill. I'm going. I'm going. <sighs> Pearls before swine, for fuck's sake. <sighs> All right. Three, two, one. Bush League punks, learn to shoot! <laughs> 
Get out of my sight! Hey, are you okay? Something wrong? <sighs> Ain't a damn thing that's right. Contest didn't do shit. Didn't sell a goddamn thing. Nothing! Should try not calling potential buyers Bush League. Yeah, maybe, but... Fuck! Gun's something you gotta respect. You don't know how to shoot, don't do it! Ugh. <sighs> Take care, V. I'll see you around. from upstairs. Remember me? Talked about Prem rides. Back then, you were pumped about the Mizutani Shion. I said it was for flash posers. <laughs> you don't forget a gunk thing like that. I was about to hightail it to the Badlands right then and there. I remember. What do you want? Just wanted to see what's shaking. Friends say you never leave your unit. Think I've got an inkling as to why. Seen that look before. It's all too common among people like us. Us? <laughs> you don't look like a cop. Badges don't get a monopoly on loss. You see death every day in my line of work. You get used to it, of course, until it hits someone you're close to. You too. Come in. I lost someone close to me, too. Damn good friend. What do you mean, too? Wait. It's about Andrew. They, uh... Told you about him. Best bud I ever had. Known in my whole life. Only person I could spill to without being judged. Guessing things at the NCPD haven't changed a lick, huh? One time, a Maelstrom ganger killed a young kid right in front of my eyes. For shits and giggles. I couldn't do shit. The son of a bitch had corporal protection. Ah, <sighs> typical. Our chief greases his palms with an anonymous donation. And guess what? Officially, kid blew his own brains out. Right in front of your eyes. Something died in me then. I couldn't do it anymore. Was... A few months later, Andrew passed and everything went to shit. You didn't have anyone to unload on at work? How about Petrova and Mendez? Yeah, Petrova's a decent gal, but she's not good with this stuff. Mendez just doesn't get it. He thinks us blues need to be tough. Can't bear the sight of a kid getting murdered. Born with pussy genes. According to him. But you told him about Andrew. Honestly, thought about it a lot. Anyway, they don't know everything. Better that way. 
Mendez doesn't know shit about life. Everyone's got their limits, even him. He just hasn't reached them. Not like you. What if he's right, though? Maybe my genes are soft. Don't only the strongest survive? If you felt nothing, that means his loss wouldn't have had any meaning. I guess so. Thanks for the talk, V. I am. Um, I need time to take all this in. Sure thing. Take care. You. You talk to Barry? He finally decided to get his shit together? I'll cry out loud, Mendez. Hey, so what exactly did Barry tell you about that friend he lost? Not much. Hardly ever spoke about him. Said once he was the only one who could understand him. It's nice to have someone like that. We had a little chat. He seems chilled, but seriously down in the dumps. Think he's got a bone to pick with Mendez. What? So why doesn't he say so to my face? Clearly, he couldn't stand his job and didn't have anyone to talk to about it. He said you didn't even try to understand him. See? Was I right? Uh, give me a break. Barry likes playing the drama queen. You just gotta shake some sense into him, trust me. We'll see. We'll have to check in on him later. Thanks for your help. This is for your trouble.
Cracked some heads open, drank the bodies inside. I told you, dog. After How's things? Don't wait. Again, solve your own problems. Clean up your own shit. Go you fuck yourself. Be careful who you bargain with. Rogue, wanted to talk. It's okay. Hmm. Not here. Not there. Who are you? Name's V. And what is it you want, V? All these years, it's really her. Fucking bro, just kicking it back on a couch at the afterlife. Don't mess with her, she's got MRI. See right through. And your services. Give her. Gotta track a guy down. Mm-hmm. Anders Hellman. Hotshot engineer, worked for Arasaka. Millisec. Anders Hellman. Pinpoint him for me? <laughs> Thanks. Jump in too soon. First, my help's got a price. Second and third, Dexter Deshawn, Jackie Wells, Tipo. Multiple bells ringing, V. Left a lot of bodies behind. Death walks in the wake. Chalk that up to bad luck? There's the bitch I know. Ask her about Suck and Tower. How they shot me up right in front of me. Wanna go through a bit? Really? Fine. Johnny Silverhand. Zeroed inside our Arasaka Tower. Before your very eyes. Got more if you want. Or we could just talk. Got nads on you, girl. Don't like that on every woman, but they seem to suit you. Anyways, feelings be damned, I've always said. This is pure biz. You need my help, so get those eddies ready. Mm-hmm. See? Uh-huh. And if I don't have the scratch, it's fuck off and have a nice day. No, more like come back when you do. Them's the breaks. Mm hmm Then, see ya. Soon. You know where to find me. Hey, interested in some work? Hey, Rogue. Got the scratch. Doing what? A business opportunity. Cargo transport. Get from A to B, quick and quiet. Interested? I'm listening. It's simple. You go to the Kabuki waterfront, collect the package, give me a call, then I tell you how to deliver it. Very straightforward. Everything except my place. Don't worry, there's a bonus in it for you. Imported and duty-free. Duty-free and detail-free. Yes, but altogether fair. It's a simple job, generously compensated. Do you accept? Yeah, sure, I'm in. Good, I knew we'd find acceptable terms. Head to the Kabuki waterfront, then search for a fridge with the words, no future. Once you locate it, collect what you find inside, then call me for further instructions. Mm hmm Till then, I guess.
fucking life. Because tomorrow ain't mine.
shit. He's in rough shape, but alive. Let's hear what Dennis has to say. Hey, got a status? Find the package? He's a little worse for wear, but no issues. What's next? I prepared a car for you. Put the man in the trunk and head to north side. The address is in the GPS. Okay. One more thing. Watch for tigers. They've got their sights trained on your new companion. We would what? Asshole hung up. Don't do this.
warriors!
job's done. I see that. Well done. Excellent work. Holding in there all right, Hariyoshi? They need to give me hope. Early warning about the Tigers would have been nice. I had a hunch you'd manage this just fine. Given that you're here now, I see I was right. So who is this guy? He'll tell you his story. Hariyoshi? In Japan, brain sergeant, top of all. Good instinct. One day, Tiger Crow boss needs surgery. But both die on table. Tiger Crows were very angry. I hide in boat, swim to America. Here, Dennis saved me. But there is secret. I killed Tiger Crow boss on purpose. World best surgeon make no mistake. This is all very heartwarming, but you haven't paid me yet. I know, here. May this blade serve you well. What's your name again? Brain Sanjon to World Best. Good to instinct. Where are you from exactly? Brain Sanjon to World Best. Good to instinct.